Nerdy Nerdigans. This is the one and only Packer Girl 89 of Nerdigans Inc. And today's manga Nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for Martial Master Asami Chapter 32. And before I get into this final live reaction, um, we are at war with YouTube's algorithm. And it is slowly but surely killing my channel. And in order to defeat this algorithmic beast, we need you to please hit that like, share, and subscribe buttons. And because, of course, this channel, let alone this video, are not sponsored. And now, we ain't sponsored by Shueisha, and we ain't sponsored by Manga Plus, and no, we ain't sponsored by Viz. And considering how much we promote Manga Plus on this channel, it's kind of surprising, right? But if you love what we're doing and want to help keep me, my adorable Will Bubba Key right here, and this operation literally alive and kicking, so we can keep bringing you more anime and manga content, whether it be news, analysis, or live reactions like this one, feel free to hit up our cash up and PayPal. Links are in the description box below. So, I am not happy that this is the final chapter of this manga because I really love it. But because this is a final chapter, um, what I do is I don't have a recap. I just go straight into it. And after I'm done, I give my thoughts on this as an ending and um, the series as a whole and how what probably could have been done to prevent this act scene. But anyways, let's get to this chapter, see um, how, it's, uh, how it's going to end. It happened when I was around six. I doubt even Nino remembers. I'm exhausted, old man. Uh, keep at it. We barely uh, even started walking. You must walk often and take in a lot of sunlight. Um, you're weak because you don't do this, Kazuro. Aww. Would you not mind doing this now? Not in front of my grandsons. Your grandsons? Huh, don't make me laugh. Someone as sinful as you trying to live the rest of your days as a common man? Absurdity has its limits. Do you know who I am? Fortunately, there are too many possibilities to venture a guest. <laughs> I will avenge my master. Face me in a fight to the death, Baku Asami. You two, turn the other way. Don't worry, this won't take long. To crib is such a badass. It only took a second. Damn. If this were 20 years ago, I probably wouldn't have stayed my hand. Uh, I've gone soft. Take uh, the life you've been spared and apply it toward other pursuits. As a precaution, I'm going to break one of your legs uh, to discourage you um, from coming after me. You were the one who wanted a fight to the death. Don't take it personally. <laughs> Dude, Grandpa's so fast. That was the day I learned the old man was scary, strong, and cool. Dude, he is. You'll scare my grandsons if you, um, if you will, so don't. Damn, I became the old man's disciple in spite of my parents' opposition. I started training because I wanted to. I didn't care how strict it would be. Listen, you two, don't use anything you learn here on your friends at school. Strength isn't meant for showing off. Dad apparently had zero martial arts uh, martial arts talent. At that point, well, it skipped a generation. I love that we're getting Kazuro's story here. This is great. At that point, the old man who had no intention of passing his techniques on to the next generation um, apparently people from other schools uh, would come to exchange techniques but even the dojo sign gifted to the old man by an acquaintance always faced inside the dojo not outside that frustrated me why it's such a waste I want more people to discover the old man's strength I loved our dad not to the same as extent as Nito but he also pissed me off you can't go dying on us damn it I'm inheriting the Asami style I'm going to pass it on I grant you this black belt I'm going to what are you doing with that belt? What's the meaning of this? Know your place, fool. It's too soon. You're nowhere near ready. Ooh. The puzzle piece. Where has this been the entire fucking time? Jesus. I know we got little bits and pieces of it, but still. Everything the old man has accumulated is slipping away. I love this. Instead of facing reality, I chose to wander the streets night after night. Till one day, I stepped on a landmine. Uh-oh. Um, hey, you seem pretty strong, sir. Want a bra with me? Low blows, thumbing. I've been in street fights in America, but you're being a little too bloodthirsty to call this a brawl, don't you think? Well, kid, what the hell are you trying to accomplish? If you keep this nonsense up, you're going to lose your life one day. I wanted to find out. I wanted to test my strength and show it off to people. I wanted to prove that I'm that, uh, that I'm, that the Osmi style is strong. I see. In that case, I think you're going about it the wrong way. An acquaintance of mine is the uh, owner of a gym called the Free Fighters Factory. It's probably the top gym in the country. Show him that card and he'll probably help you out. Give it a shot. You've got the aptitude for it, kid. Good luck. MMA? Mm-hmm. 
And oh, it says MMA fighter um, Jihiro Kitasaki. Oh God. Oh God. There's the training. There's the lion tattoo on the chest. Just another hundred grams, huh? Uh, just yeah, just another hundred grams, huh? Uh, looks like you'll um make weight. Looks like you'll make weight. Good job. Now we just have to see how much you can recover from the weigh-in to the day of the fight. This is the first time you've cut this much weight, so be careful. Uh, I'll do my best. Yeah, he's 68.12 kilograms. Jesus Christ. Um, this battle is more important to me than a title match. Huh? What are you crying about, hero? No, just, you're just so impressive, Mr. Cass. I heard you had four more kilos to go yesterday afternoon, and today you needed to drop lower than lightweight. That's your usual division, so you really have me worried. It's amazing. How'd you manage to pull it off? Guess it all boils down to love. I love fighting in combat sports. But to be honest, this time around, I'm scared. I don't want to lose. That same kid who started out watching from the sidelines. Oh, did you figure out how to do that just by watching? Amazing you have, ta uh, amazing you have talent. Somewhere along the way ended up one year ago. I played a, ma um, a major part in every aspect of this tournament, friends. Concept to uh, the selection of fighters. I searched the entire country for fighters who had skill and promise, whether they were well-known or not. Yeah. This is the J Future Cup uh, press conference. Of course he's running it. Um, its purpose is to discover and rear young fighters who can fight top overseas competitors after me. The winner will be given a shot at the belt of their weight class and an invitation to join my team in, in America. Competitors looking, uh, um, competitors I'm looking out for? Well, for me, I suppose it would be Shuko from uh, Shigeki. I'm sorry, I know uh, you called out, me out by name, but I've got a few, uh, my eyes on Reiji Tagari from, a, uh, from XFC. I'm going to crush him. Me? I've got a guy in mind, but I'm keeping it a secret. <laughs> um, in that case, my pick is also a secret. Excuse me? Um, about the prize, would it be possible for you to change it? Going overseas and title shots are fine, but there's a match that I personally want to make as soon as possible. If I were to win, would you mind granting my request? That's fine. As the bout's representative, I'll do whatever is in my capacity to make that happen. It's barely been two years since I first saw you at Yoshi's MMA. I always believed you'd make it to, uh, you'd make it to me. Uh, let's see how you shape up. Oh, yeah, we ended up getting it! In the blue corner, the winner of the J Future Cup. Now that you've gained experience and gotten stronger, Nino Asami, yes, he did it! And in the red corner, um, the bout MMA's lightweight champion, Kazlo, also known as Kazuro Asami. I don't want to lose. That's exactly why I'm so nervous. Let's put on a hell of a match, brother, by giving it everything we got. With MMA, that's with MMA, that's possible. We may be opposites in every way, but we're brothers through and through. After all, your love for this sport led you all the way here, right? Those on the outside looking in, um, looking in may never understand our reasons. Even so, we fight. Just can't see. Oh, just can't seem uh, to step away from the fight. When this last chapter is um, is titled Asami. Oh. Oh, we got fire versus water too. Where the fuck was this freaking arc, Kawada? Oh my god. Okay, in terms of an ending, getting, you know, everything from Kazuro's perspective, I really do like that. That was a nice touch, Kawada, considering the situation. I'm hoping there will be an epilogue chapter um, that, uh, you know, gives us the fight fight. Like, you know what I mean, a special chapter that gives us the fight fight. But man, as an ending compared to what I saw with uh, Dark Doctor Kuru, which I'm, I'm still sad it got axed this past week, I think this one is better. This is definitely one of the better axed endings um, I've seen. Uh, period. I'm still, Maga-chan's ending was good, but god damn, uh, it was such a tease. P -p 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 -p. Oh. That shit had no right to be axed. Shueisha, you are stupid for, uh, for axing that one in particular. But this ending is actually good, com especially compared to the other endings I've had to deal with. This ending is good. I'm sad we won't, we don't get to see what's going down with now, which really sucks. But I'm happy we have this now. In terms of the series overall, I really did enjoy the series in terms of writing. Um, the art it was good, but it was not giving me what I wanted, especially in terms of um, 
with the metaphorical or like we got in Hinamaru Sumo. I wish we would have had more of that here. I feel like if there was more of that here, um, and would I say some of the training stuff be cut down? Probably, but... I feel like the metaphorical art is part of what made Hinamaru Zumo really special. It did. And not having that much of it here, I feel like it really hurt it. I'm curious what you guys think. Maybe I'm being biased, but... This is, like, people will say that people, uh, that they're mad about, like, Phantom Seer or, um, Hunter Skill Red Hood, um... Series like the, I mean, no, people bring up Doran Dororon, stupid. Nah, Doran Dororon had every right to be axed. Or Yashimon, but Phantom Seer was in a clusterfuck of an identity crisis. There was no way of saving that. Red Hood, the pacing was just too slow at the, um, in the test arc, and it got, it was dragging. Here, I feel like this is one of those series that is kind Kind of more of a really of a fucked up axe. I really hate that this manga got axe. I do. This one should have lasted. And I know people. I know the Baki Bros are like, well, you should have just bought physical copies of um, of the Japanese release. Well, not everyone can afford that for one thing, and two. And I say in my Kagurabachi video, we have no business in interfering with um, with series that are. Um, targeted for the Japanese audience. And it really, you, you can do what you want, but it irks me. I don't like it. I really don't want to have like Western influence in, in manga like that. I really don't because then at some point you're going to have Western consultants in there trying to fuck it up. Oh God, I really don't want that. Oh. But anyways, um, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below, what you guys think of this ending, considering it, it's an act series. As I said, I think it's an, a decent ending, especially, I, but at the same time, I'm like, I wish we would have had Cosro's content so, uh, sooner from his perspective. I think that would have maybe helped it too, but let me know your thoughts in the comment section below, and remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdigan Zing. Love what we're doing and want to help keep this operation alive and kicking so we can keep bringing you more um, manga content. A few ways you can do that. Donate to our cash app, PayPal, Patreon. Purchase something off our Amazon wishlist. All that's in the description box below. Also, make sure you follow us on Twitter, Twitch, Discord. Friend us on PlayStation Network. That's in the description box below as well. And until next time, Nerdigans, I will be seeing you later. Bye.